The circumstances of the founding of Sigma Xi are unique among honor societies. Sigma Xi was founded in 1886 at Cornell University by a group of engineering students and a junior faculty member, Frank Van Vleck. Cornell geology professor Henry Shaler Williams was another early leader. The founders intended Sigma Xi to be more than an honor society. They wanted it to make a difference by encouraging a sense of companionship and cooperation among researchers in every field of science and engineering. They also wanted it to be inclusive. In 1888, five women were elected to membership, including Anna Botsford Comstock, whose handbook of nature study is still in print. Julian Herman Lewis was elected to Sigma Xi in 1913, two years before he became the first African-American to receive a PhD in physiology. Today, Sigma Xi members live and work in more than 100 countries. This is one of the oldest and largest scientific organizations in the world, and our multidisciplinary outlook has never been more relevant. Advances in science are becoming increasingly dependent on collaboration by researchers in different fields. For that to happen, scientists and engineers must interact with each other. Sigma Xi provides a focal point for that interaction. <laughs>